Okay, see now that's now now it's not loading anything. Please record. Okay, let me try a new game. Honestly, I have no idea how this game is going to perform, because it looks like it's already started right now, but it's like, oh, jeez, I had some problems dealing with this em ambulance, like, this, this wrong, because it was acting all buggy when I try like, restarting it. Like, as soon as you start the ROM, you have to, like, immediately play into it, because, like, if you don't, it, it will act, like, really buggy. Let me try one video, and if it and if it acts like crap, then I'm gonna have to put this game on hold until I find a better M ROM. Cause I don't think it's the emulator. I think it's the ROM. It is a buggy ROM. Anyways, Super and Easy here playing JoJo's Bizarre Adventure on the Super Nintendo, and from what I know, this is a, an RPG re uh, released on the. Uh, What? Um. Oh, jeez. How do I? Okay, I know there's like four buttons here. Uh, from what I know, this is an RPG. If I could figure it out. Okay. What did I? Br Oh, did I press a weird button? I don't know how the control setup is. I hope I didn't change it. Okay, now I'm not doing anything. Oh, jeez. I hope I had the controller set up. So, it's just like how I usually set up for uh, Super Nintendo games. Not something, nothing is responding. Oh, no. I would really hate to reset it. Uh, is there a way I can look at the controller setup? I have to go back to the one menu, so let me stop recording for right now. Okay. It's Okay, pushing this button. It's whatever button I assigned to X. But if I pressed S, whatever that... It'll get me to some sort of menu that I can't leave. That's going to be a problem for me when I do play. I didn't look at the menu. I was like, I didn't look at a guy to, like how the menu set up. But as soon as I press whatever I assigned S to... It leads me here, and now I can't leave. I don't know why. I'm pressing like every single button here. I can't play a game like this if accidentally push pushing a button gets me locked in this position. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Ugh, this is, it's really disappointing because, like, when I heard about this game being an RPG, like, oh, I am, I am willing to play a JoJo's Bizarre Adventure RPG. But if this could be like this buggy mess that I can't, it's like, that I can't figure out. Hold on, let me look for a guide. Okay, the guide I was looking for did not have a control se segment. Like, I have been to, I was like, I have seen multiple guys that would have control segments, like, control sections in their guide, and I'll be like, eh, whatever, I don't, I can figure out the controls for myself, I don't need a guy to tell me. But one time, I need a guy to tell me how the fucking controls work, and there, this guy doesn't ha the guy that I found didn't have one. Are you fucking kidding me? So, 
Son of a bitch. Uh, well, I was just going to talk a little bit of Joseph Bizarre Adventure because, from what I know, this game is based off of the, uh, actually, let me just, like, let me actually start playing a little bit of the game. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, and I'm curious if it is actually the ROM or the emulator I'm using, because I'm going to do this challenge of never touching that one button, or else I'm going to be freaking stuck. Uh, okay. I guess I'm going to, I guess this is going to be a one video thing until I get a proper JoJo's Bizarre Adventure ROM, you know, that actually functions right. Ah, yeah, that was Joseph Josar. What was her name again? It's been a... For one, I know this is a game based off the, uh... Jo JoJo's Bizarre Adventure OVA that came out in the 90s. And it's weird, because, like, it was split into two parts. Part 1 and Part 2. Part 1 came out in the year 2000. Part 2 came out in 1996. That's not a typo. That is the actual order the parts came out. I was confused as... I was just as confused when I found out. I can't remember your, what your name was. It's been years since I've seen the OVA. And I just started watching the 2011 series, like, last night. It was like the first two episodes with Jonathan Joestar. <laughs> so I get the feeling like it's like... If I get around to this, which is Stardust Crusaders, watching the 2011 version of that, then I might remember his name. I do know that he is the Magician. That one guy. So I just call him Magician. It's been years. You know, I have to say, the OVA that this is based off of... Oh yeah, that's Shotaro's mom right there. He's supposed to be 17 and he's like Hulk and big. I mean, I know sons are supposed to be taller than their moms, but jeez. He's a bodybuilder. Yeah, like, this is based off of the OVA, and the thing is, the OVA, it, it is kind of boring. Like, if you went into no the OVA knowing that, like, if you went to the OVA knowing how Jodoro, like, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure is this meme to show, you would be greatly disappointed with the OVA. Like, I was watching the OVA, and someone left a comment, like, this is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? It's kind of boring. I'm like, yeah, the OVA is kind of boring. You, the only memeable thing about it is the Star Platinum going oh, like that. No, what item? I was kind of not paying attention. But like, yeah, if this game's going to be a buggy mess, then that's going to be a problem moving forward. Who knows, maybe someone will leave a comment like, oh no, you actually need a certain emulator to properly play this game. Maybe I should check the Aeon Genesis website.
Oh, is that what I'm supposed to look for? I hope so. When I was watching the OVA uh, years ago, out of all the characters, Joseph jo Joestar was like my favorite character. This old guy here in brown, who's the main character's grandfather. I hope so. And the thing is. I guess I could say, like, Joseph Josar remind me of my grandfather when he was alive, before he passed away from cancer, back in 2011. That was like 13 years ago. My grandfather was strong, and the only time I've ever seen him wake was the last year of his life. Oh. Uh. Is this a battle setup? Oh, the battle's really slow paced. Yeah, I remember like uh, when I was in fifth grade, I was ten years old, and I got into an argument with this kid, and I was like, "Oh, I'll bring my sister, my older sister, who was like almost seven years old, older than I am," and this kid was like, "Oh, if you're bringing your sister, then I'm bringing my mo my dad." That this other kid did it, and like after he said it, I was like, "Oh, you bring your dad, then I'll bring my grandpa because he's strong." <laughs> And like when I when I mentioned my grandpa, I didn't bring the, I didn't mention the strong part. Like when I mentioned my grandpa, the other kid was like, "Oh, you're bringing your grandpa. You're bringing an old man." I'm like, <laughs> jokes on you. My grandpa's strong. Like, my grandpa was freaking Joseph Joestar. Yeah, I'm being very wary of this game. Like, I didn't look at the walkthrough of the guide I was looking at because I was too concerned about the controls. Because I would hate to make one false move and just lose all progress because I accidentally pushed the one button. But if it is the emulator, not the ROM, then I guess I could continue with this game. But like, if it's uh, if it is the ROM, then that's a problem in itself. Although I say one of the good things about this game so far is that I was concerned going in. Like, is it gonna start with part two or part one of Stardust Crusaders, of like the Stardust Crusaders OVA? Because like part one did start off with like Jotaro in the jail cell. And then he goes to school, where part two of the OVA just started with the group out in the middle of the desert. I'm like, oh, this is going to be a short game if we start off in the desert. 
Like, this is a Super Nintendo RPG. You better do the entirety of Stardust Crusaders. Although, even the OVA was missing some, you know, parts of Stardust Crusaders. Like, there were some characters that were not in the OVA. Uh... Hopefully not my group! Oh, seriously? Oh, I hope this is scripted, otherwise I'll be so goddamn pissed. Okay, that is three turns in a goddamn row. Okay, something tells me this is scripted. Oh, shit. Ugh. It's taking a long time just to go through these cars. I wish it was much faster. Yeah, just from one video. Just from recording this one moment right here. The game is slow paced. And it was like acting very buggy. Like when I was, in, or like when I was trying to record earlier, it was acting very buggy. Man, I was like, just from playing this game, I'm already disappointed. Just when I was like looking forward, it my expectations were high, and I'm greatly disappointed. Uh, but for all I know, this game has- this series does have, like, fighting games. Is this another scripted fight? Hmm. Is this scripted? Honestly, I don't know if I can defeat you. I'm not leaning a single hit. And I can't do anything. And I just took a quick glance at the guy because... I just want to know how the controls work. No, oh, but man... This game's not working out for me. I'm disappointed. I guess... I guess I'm gonna have to stop here. If there ever comes a time where I'll come back to this game, I could. But, like... Just from what I could see from... Right from the get-go, I was like, I'm not liking it. Especially, like, this battle right here. I can't do any damage. This is, like, one of those games where I need a guide every single time. Just so I get past a certain point, like, that's not gonna work. Because at the same time, I was like, I was getting into this game without, like, completely blind.
And I hate when I have to use the guide, like, a, 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 I hate to use a guide, like, every single time I get stuck in a game. Like, it's one thing if I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing, but this is, like, one of the, like, the first few battles in this entire game. I'm assuming the previous fight was, like, scripted, but, like, now I'm, like, stuck in this goddamn battle and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. And it doesn't help that I, if I push the wrong button, I'm in a battle, so I'll... Oh, there we go. Yeah. Uh, apparently, that's the no-no button that I pushed. Uh, yeah, this game's not working out for me. Maybe it's all be like, oh no, you gotta give it another chance. Like, nah, this game's not working out for me. Oh, I just started watching the 2011 series like last night. And I think I'm gonna watch more of it because the show is memed. But this mess, this this game is a mess.